I could have did better today, but I definitely think it better today. Hey, well, Coach Johnson. What was it that made you want to come here and do a little bit of a workout today? Uh, see how Coach Johnson coach, things like that. What do you think are the biggest things that you learned from Coach Johnson today? He's a cool guy. He taught me to keep up the energy, keep up the high intensity. Like I know you've been to Miami and LSU. How do you feel like what you've seen here compares to what you saw at both schools? Uh, out here is different, you know, different vibe out here. How so? Uh, I can tell the competitive vibe in here with all the coaches. Do you, like, you know, get a feel when you're here, like, hey, this is a place I could see myself possibly? I mean, definitely, because if I did it, I wouldn't be here. First thing, you get me? You mentioned you wanted to see how Coach Johnson coaches. What were your impressions of kind of the on-field stuff he did and, and how he handles guys? He's a great coach. And then much to say about it, he's a coach. One of the things that guys always talk about is you know, he doesn't he doesn't swear, he doesn't yell. You know, he's he's different than a lot of coaches. Did you notice that today? Yeah, I definitely did. And how, how how does that maybe change your thought about a coach when, when they kind of handle things like that? Sure. And so he's different. His way to handle the game is different. Yeah, he really kind of puts you through through the ringer there, that tough workout. How did that compare to some of the other ones you've done? Uh, it was a very tough workout. You know, it's boom, 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 high intensity, back to back to back. Yeah. I mean, but this is cool. This is a good workout. Were you, I mean, did you come here prepared uh, to work out, or was it kind of a spur of the moment thing? Uh, prepared, no. I mean, I had been out for like a couple weeks, so I haven't really been doing much. So when I got here, I got the work done. Did you get to go on tour of the facilities and stuff? What you oh, think? no, not yet. Not yet? Get that later today? Yeah. Okay. What was keeping you out? Uh, keep me out. I was when today. No, you, you said you hadn't worked out in a while. Oh, I was on college visits. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just, did did you tweak something today? It looked like they were talking to you about it. No, I was just. They just said I'm down for the day. Okay. Good enough. What What's next for you? Where else are you going to be going after this? Uh, I'll be going to Notre Dame, and from there, Florida, Clemson, you know, a lot of schools. You know, you had your, your coach was here today, your quarterback was here today. What's it like kind of going through the process with those guys as well? No, they make him a little bit more fun, you know, enjoying more, things like that. You're going to be here watching him throw today? Yeah, of course. Hello, dog. What was the biggest thing you took away from, from today that maybe you can now work on or add to your game? Uh, biggest thing I took away from today? I mean, the things we did today, like, I had done it before. Okay. Like, I did everything we did today before, so. so you were prepared for it? Yeah. Right. I know you're going to the future 50 this weekend, right? Yeah. Is there anyone specifically you're looking forward to getting matched up with over there and competing against? Uh, no, not really. I'm just really looking forward to competing over the weekend. Test out my skills, even though I've been rusty. Been out for a couple weeks. How would you describe your game to people who haven't seen you play? Uh, I'm a real fast guy, like on camera don't look like that, but like in real life, like I'm pretty I'm moving. But when that stops, uh, I got power too. So like, I'm not all speed, like, speed power is the difference. How much does the legacy of, of defensive linemen here, especially recently, you know, play into your consideration of schools? Uh, it played a big role. It makes me know that Coach Johnson knows what he's doing with his players you know, and development. What's next for you? I mean, for your, in terms of your decision, once you you know get through this month of visits, do you want to make a decision soon after June, or are you going to kind of let it ride out? I think I'm going to make a decision. I think I'm going to cut down the list before the season starts. And go from there. Yeah.